on timing, I believe. Yeah. I mean, because he absorbed P um, uh, Pikachu's thunder, so why can't you? Why can't you just absorb the explosion of a bomb? It's just most of Jamma's solid tools are range from like a mid range to a long way, long range, and I think that's has a lot to do with his projectile game. I think Ness excels at more of a post range to a mid range. Oh my gosh! But has really strong, like effective, like projectile mm. tools as well. Oh. Ooh. Right now, Austin with the percent lead. Oh, with bo um, Boomerang saving him just a little. All right, forward air pushing Jamma off Ooh. stage. Jamma not too phased, though. Ooh, yeah. two Boomerangs, three Boomerangs, four. Oh, not going to get the fourth. And back, back throw. throw. No, no. Great mash. mash. Really solid mash right there from Jamma just to <laughs> contest. Oh, just missing with it. By the last hit. Oh, that was a bait. Baited out the forward smash right there with the down throw of the boomerang. Mm. Here we go. Jam clash. Racking up that percent on Austin. Oh, the oh, Jam with the lead. Okay. There you go. All right. Contesting Austin little by little. Mm. Ooh, back throw. Get this man off stage. The grab. Oh, boomerang saving. All right, up tilt, up air, okay. Rack up that damage. Mm -hmm. Don't try to contest too much, but just back up and play out of mid-range. Austin has a lot of kill power right oh, now. No. Oh, no. And it comes in the form of that up air. Mm -hmm. Down throw combos, though, no follow-up. Oh. I don't know if that links as solidly as it used to in Smash 4, because I know at the law, low percents, he could get like down throw, forward air, forward air. And that was like a super tight string that couldn't normally be contested in like any situation. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Ooh, good coverage. Jam has got to still play at that solid mid range and try to bait out Austin's next up air. Ooh, it Ooh. catching the fire. Air dodge back to stage. Oh, Ooh. good yo yo. Oh, here we go. Jam is just right. trying to bob and move oh, as, much as, as much as possible. Mm, but that go. down smash going to give the lead back to Austin. Oh, and the fade right there. Uh, I'm not going to take it just yet. Knew he was still invincible off of getting back oh, to the stage. It. So he was able to go up and get that fair off the boomerang. Here we go! Oh, oh great good defense! Woo! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Whoa! Let's go! It looked like for a second he got shield broken with the platform, like saved it. I don't this know. This is like the first time in a long time I've seen Austin mess that up. Ooh. Okay. Okay, dash Nair, attack. two dash attack right there. Solid stuff. Okay, down throw. Gotta go for the up air, but no follow up. Austin able to spot dodge at the nick of time. Zoning it as much as he can with Nair and PK Fire. Back air. Get back air? Oh, oh not gonna do it yet. He's almost dead. Woo! Oh, oh no! Oh, oh my Ooh. gosh. It's like, okay, you set yourself up perfectly. Let's uh, go. Perfectly for failure, that is. Yep. Unfortunate right there, but good stuff to Austin taking game one. Right now, I think Jam is gonna have to really consider what the stage pick is gonna be for game two right here. Yeah. If, are there much counters to this um, Ness matchup? Um, stage wise, I think. Uh, I don't know. It's really. I guess it's really dependent on. Like what sort of bonuses like Jamma wants for a stage, and I think FD is a good place for Jamma just to not have or not let Austin have platforms just to jump over a lot of Link's projectiles. So if he wants to get close to Jamma, he's gonna have to jump in nine times out of ten. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Oh my God, these up air strings. Austin racking up the damage. Oh, oh here we go punish. again. Oh, <laughs> couldn't get a punish right there. Was a little bit too far away, but. Jamma still racking up the percent little by oh little. Oh my god, he dodged you everything. Uh, it's really easy to forget that boomerang coming back in. But yep. Austin tried to contest shield and Jamma up being at the nick of time. That is a good shield punish option for Jamma. Wow. Staying in the way of the PK Thunder right there. I can do it. Not going to do it just yet. That knockback scales a little bit heavier Ooh. with rage. Yep, catching him with the ledge grab. 
All right, here we go. Jam out. Oh, but the dash attack will kill him. Immediately firing back with that dash attack. Yep. But now Austin zoning effectively with the PK fires. Ooh. Or tilt, double four tilt right there. Jamma. Oh, and oh, Austin no. giving up a crucial air dodge. And Jamma with an early lead right now in the second stun. Yeah, he buffered that um, a B from coming out at all. Oh my gosh. Austin. Jamma's got to capitalize off of this if he wants to go into a game three. Mm -hmm. This could be a huge momentum break for Austin if he can find a way to get back onto stage. Ooh. Okay, Jamma. Patiently. Moving around, but home run. Unfortunately, drop shield right there, and we have even stocks here mm. on game two. There Austin just needs his last stock to go into winners finals, but can Jamma pull the upset and bring it to game three? Ooh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> that PK fire has been the bane of Jamma's existence this whole yeah. set. Oh my gosh, how does he do oh, that? That will do it. The kill was Zoltik. Oh my god, that trump of that yo-yo is uh, so sick. And I hate that my boy got sent to losers, but man, that just shows the quality of player that is Austin, man.